Hey everyone, the Queen is dead at the age of 96. Another one bites the dust as she once sang. Wait, no, it's Freddie Mercury. Of course not, this is Queen Elizabeth II, or Elizabeth I if you're Nicola Sturgeon. And talking about Scotland, there must presumably be a local florist in Balmoral rubbing his hands with glee at the moment and putting in a down payment for a new car. The news is reporting that the Queen died peacefully in her sleep, although there is also a rumour going around that she was actually busy cutting the brakes underneath Meghan Markle's car when the jack slipped. Her last words were supposedly, quote, Liz Truss, Prime Minister, over my dead body. But sad times all round, unless of course you're Elton John's publisher or you're in the commemorative plates industry. At this point, of course, people can now look forward to two weeks of round-the-clock news coverage and tributes. A number of TV stations decided to break the story by showing a flag and playing the national anthem. But I can't help but feel that playing God Save the Queen is a little bit late now that she's already snuffed it. Of course, being Scottish, I only bothered to learn the lyrics to the song a couple of years ago, and now it seems they're going to be changing them anyway. I'm going to be honest, initially, when I heard that God Save the Queen was being changed to God Save the King, I thought it was yet another stunt from the transgender activists. Joking aside, though, there are, of course, important matters of state to consider, like how are they going to fit Charles's ears onto the new coinage, and I can't help but feel that it comes as a bit of a kick in the teeth to the Royal Mail, who will now presumably have to spend millions of pounds changing the ER signs on their post boxes, all of which could have been avoided if the Queen had called her first son Edward. Anyway, I'll leave you with this one. What's the difference between the Queen and Prince Philip's Land Rover? The answer, of course, the Land Rover could reach 100. Anyway, see you next week. If you like these, click subscribe.